A mother and her two young daughters shopping at an Oklahoma Walmart. Little did they know that man right there was about to strike. As the mother turns toward a grocery shelf, 37-year-old Sammy Wallace snatches the two-year-old girl from the shopping cart, holding a knife to the toddler. Here it is again, the toddler now in the stranger's arms. 911, medical emergency. Hey, uh, we need police at the Walmart. What's wrong? There's someone with a knife holding a little girl hostage. First, the mom confronts him, and another shopper blocks the suspect in with his shopping cart. Police arrive, beginning 34 minutes of a meticulous rescue operation. The hostage negotiator works to build a rapport with the suspect who has a violent arrest record and a history of mental illness, but it doesn't work. Every time we felt like we could use some of the cues, in other words, talk to him about his family, his job, his interest, he would become erratic. The team moves in in a carefully choreographed formation, a police officer to either side of the suspect. It's called triangulation. That way we can try to get a good shot if we need to. Next, they offer him a chair, their goal to stop him from moving, a controlled target. Suddenly, the suspect starts counting down from 60 seconds. Police fear they are out of time. His eyes got really wide. He moved a knife from her stomach area up underneath her throat. The police act. Watch the one officer crouch down as the second officer, just out of sight, begins to speak, distracting the suspect, who turns his head to the left just for a second, but it's the opening Captain David Huff needed, moving forward, shooting the suspect at point-blank range, pulling the toddler to safety. Captain Huff's actions were extremely heroic and he waited to the very last moment. Quick thinking by police saving a lucky little girl who tonight is back with her very grateful mother. Rob Nelson, ABC News, New York.